Hey guys, uh, today I just wanted to give you a basically a 90 day review of Ice Barrel. I've almost had mine for 90 days, been doing an ice plunge about every other day for almost 90 days now. And I've made some modifications, I've made some changes to mine to try and make things better. Uh, I also need to give credit to a couple other YouTube channels. If you haven't checked it out, go check out DIY Cold Plunge. That guy has some really cool modifications that I have made to mine. Uh, he has some really great ideas. If you're not looking to get an ice barrel and you're just looking to try and do this on your own and you're a DIYer, uh, you can really make a great DIY plunge if you follow his uh, YouTube channel. So give him a shout out as well. Check out his channel. But today what I really want to do is just kind of show you what I have done. So. After about 45 days or so of using my ice barrel, I was able to find that the water was not staying as clean as I really wanted, even though I was adding hydrogen peroxide, even though the pH balance was where I wanted it. I just couldn't keep the water as clean as I wanted. And I'm gonna show you today the modification that I've made as well as show you how clean the water is now that I've been using this modification for about 20 days. Uh, so take a look here and I'll uh, show you now. All right, so what you're gonna see here, if you follow me over here, down here at the bottom where the spigot comes out, runs out, comes over here, and down inside here you have my filter and my pump. This is the Danon 1200 pump. We're gonna come up from there into the chiller and out of the chiller into my latest modification and this modification is brought to you by DIY DIY cold plunge you can see here water comes in here enters up comes through here some of the water is coming down here and being filtered by this GE zoom in there um, it's a GE house filter um, as you can tell I am not uh, <laughs> I'm not a sprinkler repair guy. Uh, I did this basically on my own, and yes, this is my first time doing this, so it's, it's kind of a mess, but it's working. The other water, the other half of the water is coming up here into this system here, where ozone's being pumped in by this ozone generator that I got from DIY Cold Plunge. He sends you out this uh, generator with the system here um, I, it's called a venturi system and essentially i'm running this for about an hour a day just to keep the water as clean as i possibly can so you can see then everything filters back right here back into the ice barrel let me show you up here the ice barrel itself and this has now been running for about 20 days and you can see right to the bottom of the ice barrel. I'm going to turn the water off. So this kind of gives you an idea of how clean it's keeping the water. Now at this point on my first go around I couldn't see the bottom of the barrel. I mean maybe I could but the water wasn't as clean as it's keeping it currently and it's it's pretty amazing how this system here, just by adding this filtration system has kept the water so fresh and clean. Uh, I feel like every time I get in now, I'm getting into a fresh batch of water. It's, it's really remarkable. So I'm hoping that this new modification made to my chilling system will continue to keep the water cleaner for longer Beforehand, I made it about 45 days before I had to hook up a garden hose down here to the spigot and empty it out through the front of my garage out into the gutter. Uh, but it worked. Wasn't a big deal, but I just preferred to not have to do it every 45 days or so. I'd prefer to be able to just keep the water clean. And so far, this system is working flawlessly keeping my temperature at 40 degrees, give or take a degree. And everything's working out amazing. So if you're looking to make a modification or an upgrade, I highly suggest take, checking out the DIY Cold Plunge channel. Check out his channel. 
he walks you through step by step all the pieces to get here to make this modification but it's all three quarter inch pvc everything that i found everything that i have here minus uh the ozone generator down here at the bottom and the venturi system came from lowe's or home depot um just your local hardware store whatever whatever you have locally but uh yeah that's it guys so so far, so good. I'm loving my ice barrel, loving getting the plunge um, about every other day right now. I'm doing four days a week, so that's what I'm doing. If you have any questions, uh, please put them in the comments. And if uh, you like this content, please like and subscribe. Thanks, guys.